the dope at the crib. Yeah. I keep the racks like a real. Yeah. I'ma go pop me a pill. Like a screw, I'ma give her the drill. Yeah, yeah. she said she love my drill. If she bad, then I'm paying them bills. I put a cat on my lip. She give me chin like a beard. Boom, before I show up, verse, and I'm coming with that line, cause I'm thuggin' for real. Not too dead partners, I ain't even speak on, cause I'm trying to put a moment. What's good, Sleep Nation, Yeremi? Yeah, it's your boy, Sleep Old Yeremi, yeah, and I'm back with another video. So. It's 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 a situation that uh, I had heard about last night when I was watching this uh, this female channel and she was talking about this YouTuber um, doing a doing a, a prank and and actually like getting shot and killed. Um, I want so this this is something that was kind of personal that I really wanted to do because I kind of want to talk to you guys about it and for the upcoming YouTubers like myself. And also the big YouTubers that's that's way bigger than me, million subscribers and stuff like that. You know, I just wanted to speak first. I'm, I want to hear what she got to say first, and then I'm gonna give my opinion. You know, if I agree with her, if I don't agree with her, if I agree with her, some you know some things or what. You know what I mean? So I ain't gonna just talk too much. I'm gonna get straight into the video. Girls can't ever say they want it. Girls be long Girls can't ever say they need it. Girls be Welcome back to my channel and if you're new to my channel welcome to my channel my name is tony brian and my channel is all about beauty fashion and discovery and if you guys want to see more content from me please go ahead and click that subscribe button right now down below so this story literally just came out i believe yesterday but basically a youtube star named timothy wilkes who was just 20 years old was killed after doing a youtube prank 20 years old the kid was 20 years old bro so on Friday night, that was February 5th, I believe, Timothy went to a parking lot and decided to pull out a bunch of butcher knives to a group of men as a prank. So a man named David Starnes Jr., who was a part of the group that was getting pranked, said that he shot Timothy and was not aware that this was a so-called prank. He was basically saying it was self-defense because he thought that Timothy was there to hurt him. And Timothy was there with a friend as well, if you guys were curious. And Starnes has not yet been charged with the crime. So that's all that's to the story as of now. So my opinions, do not go up to random people doing pranks. That makes absolutely no sense. Agreed. I have seen so many people do so many insensitive pranks, especially during the times, that it makes you can't be shocked when something like a death happens. I feel so sorry for this young man that did lose his life. He was my age, and what he did was foolish. But Everything she's saying is real. You know, um, she, but the way she's saying it, she's being respectful, and I understand. But me... Bro, I, I have to tell it like it is. He was being stupid. That's stupidity. You, what type of prank do you run up on somebody with a butch? And she said butcher knives, like multiple. You know what I'm saying? What what prank is this? Like you guys comment. Let me know what prank is this where y'all running up on people. I ain't gonna say y'all, but y'all seen people run up on people with butcher knives. Guess what? If I was with my little my little boy and somebody run up on me with a butcher knife, guess what? I'm 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 a I'm a peel that shit back. I'm a blow them I'm a blow them I'm a blow them away too. You hear I me? Mean? Like, what type of prank is y'all going around with butcher knives, bro? Everybody not going for that. Rest in peace to the little man. You hear I me? Mean? And I apologize. I ain't gonna, I can't say I apologize, but I'm sorry that it had to go like that. But, bro, that's stupidity. Don't be stupid. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Y'all YouTubers that are doing these pranks, bro. But I don't want to speak bad on the dead, should I say. I already know his family is mourning. So I ask that y'all even try and chill out in the comments about um, Timothy's death. But yes, you guys really have to be more careful. A lot of people are doing YouTube pranks and doing YouTube challenges and doing all this crazy stuff for views. Views and popularity is not worth your life. Be smart. If you want to get on the YouTube platform, do something that you're good at. A lot of people just go down the, I like to call it the stupid route because it's like easy views. I just I personally don't believe in like the YouTube pranks. I don't believe in like the YouTube challenges. 
People do it for the views. I definitely agree, bro. And I understand you want to get big on YouTube. Shit, I want to get big on YouTube. But sometimes it's not worth it. You know? You got, like, I was looking at with her little screen where, um, you know, some people, like, had a, a hickey prank. And then they had, I broke up with my girlfriend on Valentine's prank. Um, it had another one that said, uh, I think a, girl, a lady stabbed stabbed her, her husband or boyfriend or something to death or something. Bro, like these pranks, bro, like it may be funny games to you, but people take this serious. Like like me, I don't like pranks. You know what I'm saying? Somebody do a prank on me, I'm gonna be pissed. If you my friend, we're gonna have to fight because like, bro, just, you know, chill out. I, I don't like that shit. Exploiting your children. So many people do so many foul things just for popularity and it is honestly right. disgusting. I don't think there's anything wrong with doing a prank or a few pranks, but if your channel's really based off of pranks, whether they're fake or not, I just think that's ridiculous. Leave innocent people out of it. I, I would say pranks, like funny pranks that ain't gonna get you killed or something, cool. You know what I'm saying? Shit that's funny, like, like acting like, I don't know, talking like you from another uh country or shit like that that's funny pranks i laugh at shit like that um you know but like knives acting like you getting shot shit like that bro y'all tripping i've seen people during covid when covid first started doing sneezing or coughing on people pranks that is not Sneezy. funny you could literally lose your life and you're putting others at risk as well because Thanks. you want to get some views on tiktok or views on youtube be smart about it so that is really my views on the story i hope timothy rests in peace right. um it's very tragic very sad his life did not need to end right. um right. just something as serious as pulling out knives on somebody what do you expect to happen like i don't i hate to say it but you know the play stupid games win stupid prizes phrase fits perfectly for this scenario right. be smart about the content that you're putting out and just be smarter about the way you think put yourself in the other person's shoes and think about hmm if someone pulled out a bunch of knives on me how would i react i recently just saw a movie about this like literally last week basically his friends put on a huge prank and at the end somebody died and they're all like oh he killed him right. oh my god you guys just put on a prank making it seem like the opposite guy was trying to kill him what do you expect him to do right. like sometimes pranks are just too, like pranks you gotta chill out with the pranks and i honestly don't think that um the man that killed him what's his name again david starnes jr i don't think that he should be convicted for his death at all I me neither I, I don't i don't think he should be charged or convicted for murder or any of that you know he didn't know you know, what would you do? You know, you with your kids, you with your family, you with your buddies, you know, trying to go have, they was at a trampoline park. So clearly he probably had some kids there, you know what I'm saying? Or relatives or something. And a, a group, and like, what they said, a dude run up with, uh, with butcher knives at you? Man, I'm about to and pull out that, you know what I mean? That glizzy. And I'm about to, I'm about to, Fill them up with them hollows, bro. I'm not about to play with that because I got a, I got a baby to go home to. You hear me? I got a little son to go home to. So, no, I, I agree with her fully. The man shouldn't be charged. I definitely would say it was self-defense. And I know he probably is traumatized from the situation since he did find out it was a prank. But mm -hmm. he did that from all the knowledge that he knew. All he knew was that there was a man with knives pretending to attack him and his friends or the group that he was with. Like, what do you expect him to do? So yeah, that is the end of this video. I would like to know your opinions in the comments. Please be respectful because like I said, there is a family morning at this time. But yeah, I would love to know what you guys think. And yeah, I will see you all in my next video. Love you guys. Bye. Mwah. I'm just saying, bro. You know, just being honest. Let me see. Let's see what some of these comments talking about. This generation better stop trying to get clout over dumb pranks. People ain't out here playing. I agree. I feel bad for the shooter. Imagine being a good person thinking you are protecting yourself just to find out it was a 20, 20, I guess, year, yeah, year old playing a game. I feel horrible. I would too, definitely. But, you know, he shouldn't have been playing. Uh, he better not get charged with anything. I'd be down if I go, if I get jail time because someone tried to prank me facts hear me like for real but come on man the proof is there
You know what I'm saying? And whoever was the guy recording, like recording the prank, I know he felt horrible. It probably was one of his good friends. Probably was his personal uh, uh, cameraman. Probably was a family member. I know he feels super bad for watching his whatever get gunned down with this stupid ass shit. You know what I'm saying? If you run at me with a knife, I would do the same. This is so sad. Unnecessary. Rest in peace. Real shit. I feel nothing. Uh, I guess... I would hope this person is saying, like, I would feel no type of way for killing them, but how can you not? We human, you know, we're we not machines. We, we have, you know, emotions. No such thing as and I'm robbing you prank. Facts. Yeah, that's not a prank. That's attempted <laughs> robbery with a deadly weapon. Facts. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. Yep. Real shit. It's just a prank, bro. Right, it's just a prank, bro, right? Bro, they are, and they all saying the same thing. You know what I'm saying? Just looking, just skimming. I noticed these prank YouTubers going to black neighborhoods with their pranks. I don't know why you gotta, you know, add racial in there, but wasn't this YouTuber known for trolling people in black neighborhoods? Okay, well, maybe, maybe, maybe he, he was going to black neighborhoods on purpose to like, you know, troll, which it's not a good idea, you know what I'm saying? With all the, you know, the Black Lives Matter and and the Trump stuff going on and, you know, the Biden stuff going on and, you know, police killing blacks and stuff like that, you know what I'm saying? Me, I have nothing against no white people. I got a lot of white friends. I got a lot of Asian friends, a lot of Hispanic friends. So me personally, I'm not, I'm not on that whole racial thing. I love everybody, you know what I'm saying? As long as you love me, I love you, but you know, everybody, not every skin, uh, man of color is not like me. You know what I'm saying? So it's people that actually don't like white people because they feel like um, white people, um, you know, are killing us by asking, you know, police and shit. Uh, this guy better not be charged. Da, da. But yeah, bro, I agree with just looking through the, um, you know, all, all the 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 comments is is saying that basically the guy shouldn't be charged which i feel like the same thing he shouldn't be charged you know what i'm saying um you know you play stupid games you win stupid prizes that's the that's the best way you can sum this up rest in peace to the the little the little uh uh you know 20 year old i'm sorry that it had to go like that but bro hopefully you know, this incident let all these YouTubers understand that, bro, people carry out here. People are carrying guns. And they are carrying guns more now than it's ever been. You know what I'm saying? So just be careful out here. Um, if you don't have a gun and you're over 21, get a gun. Um, I would say if, you're, if, if your state is like concealed carry, like you can conceal it, legally without a license cool if you if you can't get a license bro don't walk around here with nothing because bro people are crazy nowadays a lot of stuff is happening and i don't want to have to see another youtuber another person another whatever you know shot for like stupidity like this you know what i'm saying this could have went a lot of different ways you know he they could have shot the cameraman too thinking he was in on it you know but um, you know, I just want to send condolences to the family. Um, I don't know you guys, but I know it's hard to, you know, have to bury like your, your young sibling, like so at a young age, bro. Like that, that sucked. But, um, I'm going to say to sleep nation, y'all, please be careful out here. You know what I mean? Please, please, please be careful. Um, and you, you know, just stay safe, bro. Stay safe. But, you know, that's the end of this video. I just want to do this real quick. Uh, Cause I, like I said, I seen it last night and I said I was gonna wake up and speak on it. So, you know what I'm saying? I just want to give my advice. Hey, hey, drop a comment. What y'all think about this? You know what I'm saying? What y'all think about this situation? You know, so I can interact with y'all. Cause I'm gonna be commenting back to all of you guys and shit like that. So yeah. Um, for the, you know, the Sleep Nation that's here, thank you guys for the new views that's watching this. Um, don't forget to subscribe, you know, 
Don't forget to like this video and drop a comment. Um, we just hit a thousand subscribers. I looked at it. We're at 1100 now. So we didn't gain a whole hundred subscribers since then. So, you know, we on the way up, you know, more content on the way. And, um, yeah, sleep nation forever gang.